Hi, today for all of you eggplant lovers who keep asking me for eggplant recipes, we're going to do the eggplant bundle. It's not like we bundle them together, but we're going to stuff eggplant with um, almond, garlic, parsley, and then cook it. It would be a nice main dish for vegetarian, or it can be a nice side dish. So this is basically, it's one eggplant. When you buy an eggplant, make sure it's nice and firm. If it's soft, that means it's one bad. And I don't fry, so what I do is just cut them into half inch thick, place them in a cookie sheet. I leave the skin because without the pepper, you leave the skin, this pepper wanna stay. And because this is high fiber, and then what I do, I just basically, I'm going to do this another one. I just, with olive oil, I use my hand. A true chef use their hand. No gloves, no brushes. That's it. And then I'm going to take it and broil it in the oven until it's nice golden and brown. So we have the eggplant. We just broiled them. They're nice and golden. We didn't have to fry. It's healthy. They're white on the other side, but don't worry about it. They're already cooked and we're going to, it's not going to show. So while they're cooling down, we're going to make the stuffing. The stuffing, you have uh, Italian parsley nicely chopped. We have about eight tablespoons of garlic, freshly crushed garlic. I use out of garlic. My husband said any lips that touch garlic won't touch his lips. So I make a point of eating garlic every day. Then we have nice toasted almond. We crush them, but not very fine because you want to have a nice bite. They make it nice surprise when people bite into their food. Lemon zest. Try to zest the whole lemon. And try not to destroy your fingers in the process. Salt. Pepper. Mix. And trust me, the stuffing itself tastes very good. So now just turn it to the other side. Take about a heaping tablespoon, fold it, and just place it in a baking sheet. And we'll do that again. Okay, we see nice bundle each one could make a meal by itself or two and then you take some diced tomatoes a little bit salt a little bit pepper you can always add salt to the table and take that put it on top and by the way you can have it raw you don't have if you want to have it raw don't use any of the canned tomatoes use fresh tomato and you just have it as a cold nice appetizer we're going to bake it 395 for 15 minutes. You don't have to bake it longer because everything's cooked. You just want to bring all the flavor together. So now we'll just take it to the oven. So we have now the eggplant bundles are ready. Just put it on your dish. It smells great. It looks better. And let's see the flavor. The almond adds a wonderful texture. It's a great dish. You can eat it hot or you can eat it cold. Enjoy.